a heartbroken rabbi returns to his house of worship. For a moment I felt like I'm standing at a cemetery and this is a massive mausoleum. Um, and it's my home and it's been desecrated. He was inside when evil entered what was sacred ground. It can't be used again in its present condition. Um, the bullet holes are, are, are too numerous to count. The heart of Pittsburgh's Jewish community grieving the loss of 11 souls, including Dr. Richard Gottfried. There aren't even words to describe where, how I feel. I'm devastated. I mean, he was my baby brother. He hid inside a utility closet with his younger sister. She is still too shaken to talk about what happened, but her sisters say she told them. He walked in and said, all Jews must die and open fire. The complainant says they have an active shooter in the building. Bloodshed in his wake, armed with an AR-15 and three handguns. Authorities say 46-year-old Richard Bowers tried to shoot his way out of the synagogue, wounding six others, including four police officers, before surrendering. The suspect's neighbors stunned. It's very upsetting knowing that someone that had that much hate was on the other side of my wall. A community looking to faith to move forward. You can cut off some branches, but the tree will continue to grow and we will be back. Back after yet another senseless loss. Wendy Woolfolk, NBC News, Pittsburgh.